morning everybody um, I'm just walking quickly to the hot springs it's, it's really windy today so yeah I hope that you guys can hear me well like loads of water inside the road so because like literally next to me right over here is like a uh, place where water runs down uh, so yeah but we'll just go and explore a little bit more hope the wind isn't too too much but it's a beautiful place hope you guys can see clearly because this camera is in wide angle mode just to help it from shaking but yeah so the water runs down just right around here and it goes uh, underneath the or through underneath the, the road just up here and it's like very hot not very hot but it's hot water so and the water comes from somewhere there I'm not sure can't really remember but yeah that's as far as I know this is where it runs down and I would like to go and see why the water is this browny, brownish color because it normally it doesn't usually look like that so maybe it's just a pipe that's dirty or something but sure i'm just like walking next to where the water is flowing up see the water comes down here so you can see where all the uh bushes are that's where the water is and that's actually an indication that there's water um so yeah but sure <laughs> from here it just goes up or actually runs down from up there it goes down there with a pipe next to that one of the bigger buildings behind um, there at the back uh, and then it runs down in this channel I would always almost say I could almost say channel I'm not sure but yeah it goes down here and then there's a dam where we just been um, uh, where this water goes to yeah if, if if someone is working with you know a mind and you know uh, put his thoughts correctly into action then uh you, one could say that they can uh actually use and repurpose this whole facility you know and use it for something else you know um because that's what i would do I would have done uh, if it would have been mine now we're just coming up to a place where uh, when we were little kids little kids people used to come this actually used to be a very lively place where people could come and uh, camp you see on the on the lawn just back there on the lawn that was literally like the uh, the lively part of what this place used to be so And one thing that I like about the grass over here, it just grows naturally. It's just this soft pack of lawn that is just here, you know? Nobody waters it, nobody cuts it. It's just nice, soft and squishy. <laughs> and this is where the water comes out. As you can see, it's nice and clean. I don't know whether you guys can see that there's like steam also because it's nice and hot water. Uh, it's like really it's really nice and hot it's like really hot um, and then it goes down with this pipe straight up uh, into the curve 
and I'm not sure where it ends, but yeah, it ends ends down somewhere, somewhere the borehole is somewhere there. Um, nice, hot, very clean water. Um, sure, it's lovely, it's lovely. Then it flows down to that part, and then underneath the ground goes a pipe uh, that leads to there, and then it flows, just flows down uh, to you know where we've just been and then it goes down to the to the dam i can't really see the dam from up here uh it's actually very difficult for the uh would have be would be diff very difficult for the camera to be to see the dam up there so yeah but it's all open and i guess this would be this would make like the ideal place you know the place where people can come and they can camp you know Especially when you have this type of facility, you know, have a hot springs here and not able to utilize it, to use it for what it's worth, you know. Let's just see if there's any water in the tap. Uh, no water. This would have made for a very nice place, you know. Just walking in places and I'm, I'm not even sure that I, whether I'm allowed to do that. But this is like completely built out of stone, as you guys can see. Of rocks of rocks actually rocks um, and yeah it's actually beautiful if you can just clean it off again it's full of dust as you guys can see there are rocks up there so yeah um, but yeah this is also another door that is open and but this is this is rubbish this is not even you know in a way Jeez. site office you know what, I, I can't remember that I've seen this quite a, you know, like years ago or some time ago. I can't remember that I've seen it. So it might have been put up here, you know, very recently. So yeah, but this, that's also supposed to be, I think it's a room. This is also a room, number three. This is also a room, I guess. What's happening in here? Yeah, this is also a room. It's also just a room. Um, so, and this is where you go out the back. I thought this would be like a kitchen or something. But sure, it's not. But sure, let's just get out of here before somebody comes in, kick us out or kill me or something. <laughs> sure. Nice place. So in this place you can see with all the fence around it. This were a place where there was a pool like right here in the middle. Where they would uh, put hot water into the pool and people could come and relax inside the hot water. Um, but yeah, it's been closed off. Or for, for At that time it was closed off. So that the baboons, because they, you know, they have like, in this place there's like loads of baboons. And they would just come and, you know, just thresh this place. But this was just to keep them outside and keep them from uh, coming in, 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 into this, into this uh, site, you know, and come and mess inside the water. And as you can see, the down on the ground here actually is a boon poop, you know, just laying here. And you can see how many they actually come here and play inside this place. And in one of these places were also like um, a big, a big uh, pool, I think, um, where the water just flow in, and then people could come and you know sit inside the water, enjoy the water. And I think, I think, I almost think it's this room. Um, almost think it's this room. I'm not quite sure, but I think it's that room. But for me, just to see this place like this, you know, and know that. This place has so much potential, you know, a, a way that can bring you in money in such a big way and, you know, be an income, you know, and people just decide, ah, uh, you know what, just leave it, leave it like this. Uh, we're not going to worry about it anymore. Um, so, yeah, and, and when we were kids, we used to come here in this tree, this is a lemon tree has been here for many years um, since we were kids. I guess when we were kids, we, you know, it just has been here. 
Um, uh, we used to come and pick picked off lemons, and I think there's yeah, there are some buds on it. Uh, yeah, as you guys can see, there are the little buds, flowers and stuff. This is where this place gets its name from, uh, Hot Springs, you know. Um, in Afrikaans, it's Warmbad. Actually, that, that's the name Warmbad, but it's the Hot Springs. It's actually because of the hot water that's in this place. Some myths or some people actually say, because there are very, like, loads of uh, black rocks um, laying around, black stone, and, uh, you know, you will find it like literally all over the place, like down there. Um, but some people say the water is hot because of a volcano that erupted about, I don't know how many years ago. And that's also where the black stone come from. Um, I'm not really sure, but I also, you know, I don't actually know any of this, of these things. So I can't also argue with people when they say that that is the reality of this place. But sure. Um, um, I'm just here to enjoy this spectacular view. Um, if you can watch down, uh, I think we should go into the sun and into the wind again. And then you guys can see it's just like really wide open spaces, you know. And then at the back, there is the mountains. Um, it's like right at the foot of the mountain where this place is located. And it's actually in such a very nice uh, position uh, actually to be able to be utilized for, you know, the best things are actually quite nice. And, you know, with heaps and loads of potential, you know, if I have an option to be able to buy this place, I think I would, you know, really just like really liven up this place, you know, get it all together again. Um, not everybody thinks the way I think. So, yeah, um, because that's actually the plan which I have. Uh, that's actually the, th the, the, the things that I'm thinking about, you know, I guess it's just, <laughs> I can't, you can't always, you know, not everybody see the world the same way that you see it. Everybody has their own view. But sure guys, thanks for watching. This is, I've, I have to walk down now again Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, so this is going to be a home for me for the next few days. And then I'm going hopefully down to Neisner. If plans works out as, or if, if things works out, worked out, works out as planned. And I'm going down to Neisner and then uh, I'll be back home very soon. So, because then the holiday is over and we have to be back at school again. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed this. And yeah, stay tuned for the next one. Just remember, keep riding, stay safe, and don't stop living.